And we're getting uh, more insight about the requirement to get tested for COVID-19 by the City County Health District. Uh, you'll remember, uh, it was just yesterday, we heard from a local mom who'd been denied getting tested five times, only to later learn that she was indeed positive for the virus. Our Bill Churchwell kicks off our top story tonight. Well, today, Annette Rodriguez, the director for the City County Health District, going before council members to give an update on testing in our area. First, explaining that there are two ways to get tested for COVID-19. One is through the Health District. That's the testing going on at the old Christus Bond Memorial. It's for folks who are greenlit when calling that 826-7200 number. And the second way is through commercial testing. That is a test collected at a doctor's office or hospital, and the test is done in a private lab. With this test, you do not need to meet eligibility. To date, there are more than 400 tests that have been done by the Health District, numbers that seemed low to Council Member Rudy Garza. Is that because of the number of kits that we have available? Is that because of the resources we have? Rodriguez explained the health department must go by CDC requirements in order to approve a test for a person. Till you open it up to be able to test everybody, uh, you actually just have to, um, you're gonna see those numbers continue to be a little bit smaller. She explained that the guidelines that first focused on travel overseas to places like China have since changed, but still, have a big focus on travel. Where there's a high number of people that are infected, uh, an example would be New York, uh, mm -hmm. uh, Washington State. She says if you come into contact with a person who is COVID-19 positive and are showing symptoms, you would be eligible for a test also. If you are symptomatic and you have comorbidities, you're diabetic, you have heart disease, some other comorbidities, you would be eligible for testing. Age is another factor. And the final one is that if you don't know what is causing your illness and you have symptoms, you are eligible for testing. Rodriguez did emphasize that if you are turned down by the health district to get a test through them, that you can always go through your doctor or even the hospital to get that test. However, keep in mind that is something you might have to pay out of pocket for if your insurance doesn't cover it. Bill Churchwell, 3 News.